It's day one of the seven day Galway Summer Festival at Ballybrit on Monday evening and there is a hundred thousand euro guarantee for the pick six. Leg one, well that's a two mile novice hurdle and Willie Mullins has ruled in this race in the last couple of years. He's won it three times in the last four years. He didn't win it last year, that's because he had no runner. He holds the key here with easy game. Very impressive winner at Killarney on his hurdles debut. Ruby Walsh back from four and a half months on the sidelines. He takes the ride. So easy game, is a, it deserves to be favoured and deserves to go in every coupon. So certainly include easy game in your coupons, but also include Devil's Glen, who was very, very impressive. He might have started a big price at Tipperary but he was very, very impressive there. And the comments after the race from Barry Connell suggest that this could be a decent novice. So in the leg one, it is number five, Easy Game, and number four, Devil's Glen. Moving on to leg two, it's the 555. It's a two-mile handicap hurdle, and this is the trickiest of all puzzles to solve. It's very, very open. It's five to one the field. Angdor Javalex, trained now by Gordon Elliott, could find significant improvement now that he switched tables. Davy Russell takes the ride. He's an eye-catching jockey booking. Uh, number 11, Modcom Street. Well, Shark Hanlon, he loves to have a winner for the Mies at Galway. I reckon this horse has been laid out for this race, so he's a must in all coupons. And also number 16, Dixie Highway, who is not the easiest to win with, but a track like Galway could suit Dixie Highway. He ran so well last time at Gorham Park. So in leg two, the 555, number two, Angedor Javalex, number 11, Modcom Street, and number 16, Dixie Highway. Moving on to the 625, it's the seven furlong maiden. Always a hot maiden. Always Dermot Well seems to save one for this maiden. He's won it seven times in the last 10 years. And on this occasion, he's got number eight on your race card, Third World, who ran really, really well to finish fourth in a hot Curra maiden last time. That was won by Guaranteed, who has franked the form since. He looks a really nice individual and is worth including in your coupons. And also number nine, Wargrave, who started 13 to 8 for a Curra Maiden won by Landforce. Really promising signs there, stayed on quite strongly. And for Foz Fozzy Stack and Chris Hayes, I'd say Wargrave could be above average. Moving on to the 705, it's a seven furlong handicap. Joseph O'Brien has a column in the race and post all week, and he is very, very keen on Rapture's Delight here. He thinks that this horse will revel in the testing conditions, and he's expecting a big run from Rapture's Delight. Uh, so Rapture's Delight is certainly worth including. He's number five on your race card and also worth including in your coupons is the Dermot Well trained Tashman who wears a visor for the first time and could find improvement in that visor. Moving on to the Connacht Hotel handicap, that's leg five, it's at 7.40. And it's all about Lamini. Is she thrown in? She's off a mark of 89. She's rated 152 over hurdles. She's a Cheltenham Festival winner. Patrick Mullins has never won the race before. He's never going to get a better chance. Certainly Lamini deserves to be favoured. And of course, we've got to include the superstar mayor in all your pick six coupons. But just in case, let's also include Golden Spear from the Tony Martin stable, who's got a crack in Galway record. Golden Spear. Seems to have been laid out for the race. Maxine O'Sullivan takes the ride. And if the race does fall apart up front, Golden Spear is going to be the one that's going to be flying home. So Lamini and Golden Spear in the feature Connacht Hotel handicapped. And in the sixth and final leg, it is the one mile four handicap. And I think the Dermot Well trained Imran, is so impressive in winning uh, a Limerick maiden, can score here off an opening mark of 89. Where's a visor? Looks to be well treated on what we've seen so far. So Imrana can give Dermot Weld a great start to the week. That's your pick six coupon. That's 48 units at one euro per unit will cost you 48 euro. Don't forget you can do the pick six, which is guaranteed for 100,000 euro on course or online on www.thetote.com.